17 Health Watch, the Medical Board of California held its first ever meeting in Bakersfield today, focusing on maternal health. This after local advocates called on the board to take action and address the Central Valley's maternal mortality crisis. 17's Michaela Armstrong joins us in studio with more. Michaela? According to data, the Central Valley has the highest maternal mortality rate in the state. Advocates came to the board today, many having lost family members to medical negligence, hoping the board would recognize it is time to change that. It was a day filled with emotions, tragedy, and loss. Family shared their story with the board of their experience of medical negligence, racism, and more, which ultimately resulted in a traumatic pregnancy themselves or the death of a loved one. She never got a chance to hold her baby. This was totally preventable. Who will never know his mother's touch. Who will never feel his mother's touch. We are a family trying to pick up the pieces. On that day, we did not just lose a mother. We lost a mother and a baby. Some even bringing the remains of their child with them, showing doctors what they now have to live with. This is preventable. This is absolutely preventable. She should be here. And she had the right. It's kind of stop because you will have another mother. You will have another mother sitting here saying the same story unless you guys make changes. As maternal mortality rates continue to increase in Kern, Latina and African American women remain disproportionately impacted. Advocates ask the board to not only address the crisis, but implement reform in the health care system. There is something wrong here. We can't let the repeat offenders get away with it. With all hoping their stories would resonate with the board enough that more in Kern and statewide would not have to share in the same grief. It's sad all the way around. It's sad that we're in a club that nobody wants to be in. And that's losing our children. This is so overwhelming. I'm actually being set back emotionally. What I can't give up because other families are going to lose a life if I quit on their watch. And so it's really about doing the work so that other people can be safe. Today concluded the board's two-day stop here in Kern, but many advocates tell me the work for justice does not end here. Michaela Armstrong, 17 News.